What's up guys, it's Reptile, and today I'm going to be showing you how to paint up a denim jacket. I know a lot of people like to dye their jackets, especially if you have like a blue jacket or a gray jacket and you want a black, people will dye their jackets. I don't do that. I just use a gloss acrylic black paint and it kind of uh, it gives the jacket a whole new texture. It's kind of like rubber. It makes it all shiny and rubbery and pretty cool. And I also know a lot of disc rockers. Likes to uh, religiously paint up their jackets with gloss paint. So let's get right into it. Okay, so first things first, you're going to need a denim jacket. It doesn't matter the color. I'm going to be painting this blue one black. If you have a black one and you want it to be shiny and glossy, just it's the same steps, same black paint. Doesn't matter the color of the denim, but you can get these at thrift stores, pretty much anywhere in thrift stores. They're like pretty easy to come by. Um, you're also going to need a sponge brush. Um, it's optional. You can use your fingers or an actual sponge. That's just what I use. But yeah, this is pretty simple, straightforward. So uh, let's get right into it. Also, you're going to need some gloss black acrylic paint. Anywhere from two to three for a whole jacket. Um, maybe even more if you're big, but at least two, two to three to start off with. So here we go. You just want to get your jacket nice and flat and laid out along the fabric seams. All smooth, no wrinkles. Um, you could also get some cardboard or some newspaper and put it on the inside. If you're worried about getting the inside of your jacket covered in paint, I'm not going to worry about that because... I'm just a messy person, so I really don't care. But you could do that. But yeah, jacket's all nice and flat and ready to go. You're going to take your paint, shake it up. And it's just really, it's really just this easy. Just squeeze your paint out. Okay. And then you're going to lather. Just lather it on, okay. And you're going to repeat... Steps one and two for the whole jacket. All right, I'll show you when I'm done. Fantastic. Would you look at that? So we got the front of our arm. Now, uh, hypothetically, like if you just wanted to do your arms and like leave the front of the jacket blue or whatever color it is, you could take some like a painting, painting tape and just run it along the seams so you don't get any over... Like over paint over here, over spray, whatever you want to call it, over spray. I don't know. But yeah, I'm not doing that. The whole jacket's gonna be black, painted black. So uh, let's finish the front and then we'll do the back and I'll show you. So yeah, I'm still doing the front. And you can see, like, uh, while I'm working on that first layer, you could still see some of the blue underneath. Don't initially drench it, just get like a nice solid layer for your first layer and I'm gonna finish up my first layer here show you when I'm done so here's a helpful hint if you are painting like a blue jacket you're gonna want to get this front part of the collar right here and even like this inner seam that way like when you're wearing the jacket people don't see a blue jacket underneath like when your jacket opens up you know what I mean I don't know. It's what I do. Also, obviously get the collar, but get underneath the collar. Okay. We might be messy, but we're not lazy. Okie dokie, dildos. So we got the front of our jacket painted. It looks like a mess. That's okay. Because it is a mess. We're going to flip it over and paint the back. All right. All right. So we got the front and back. All painted with our first layer of paint. Now I know the lighting's really shitty, but if you come down here and look, you'll see that there's little blotches of blue, or even just see underneath denim coming through. So we're gonna go back and do a second layer of paint, uh, just like we did with the first. Same concept, same techniques. 
So let's get to lathering. And before I get too carried away, you always want to make sure that you're uh, double checking your seams for uh, blue or whatever the underneath color of the denim is. Um, also things like this. Make sure you paint under there, up here on the collar, these side seams. Get what I'm trying to say? You want to make sure those are black and there's no blue or whatever denims underneath. All right. So here we go. We got our second layer done. We're going to let it dry overnight and I'll show you then. All right, here we are. We got our two layers. You could do a third layer if you want. If you want it to be extra glossy, you kind of see the little bit of the gloss. But yeah, I'm only going to do two. This is pretty much it. Um, you're going to want to wear it and break it in because it is kind of stiff. But once you start wearing and breaking it in, it'll be fine. This is the finished finished jacket. And um, yes, you can wash these. You, you can machine wash your jackets. Just uh, wash it with cold water on delicate. And I would air dry it. I, I wouldn't put it in the dryer. Just air dry it. But that's what I do. There. Now you know. Hey! 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 H